Welcome to Academic Gain Tutorials. In this video, we will look into the differences between product cost and period cost. Based on the association with the product, cost can be classified as product cost and period cost. Product cost is the cost that is attributable to the product, that is, the cost which is traceable to the product and is a part of inventory values. On the contrary, period cost is just opposite to product cost, as they are not related to production. They cannot be apportioned to the product, as it is charged to the period in which they arise. So, let's look into the basic differences between product cost and period cost in a tabular form. Difference number 1, product cost is the cost which can be directly assigned to the product, whereas, period cost is the cost which relates to a particular accounting period. Number 2, product cost is based on volume because they remain same in the unit price, but differ in the total value. On the other hand, time is taken as a basis for period cost because as per the matching principle, the expenses should match the revenue and therefore, the costs are ascertained and charged in the accounting period in which they are incurred. Number 3. In general, the variable cost is considered as product cost because they change with the change in the activity level. Conversely, the fixed cost is regarded as period costs because they remain unchanged irrespective of the activity level. Number 4. Product cost is included in the inventory valuation, which is just opposite in the case of period cost. Number 5. Product cost comprises of manufacturing or production cost, whereas, period cost comprises of non-manufacturing cost, that is, office and administration, selling and distribution, etc. Number 6. Product cost is a part of cost of production, but period cost is not a part of part of cost of production. And, difference number 7, examples of product cost include, cost of raw material, production overheads, depreciation on machinery, wages to labor, etc. Whereas, examples of period cost include, salary, rent, audit fees, depreciation on office assets, etc. In a nutshell, we can say that all the costs which are not product costs are period costs. The simple difference between the two is that product cost is a part of cost of production because it can be attributable to the products. On the other hand period, the cost is not a part of the manufacturing process, and that is why the cost cannot be assigned to the products. So, these are the differences between product cost and period cost. If this lecture was helpful, give it a thumbs up, and subscribe to the channel. Thank you.